guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting to Rain to episode 4 of Didn't I Say to Make My Abilities Average in the Next Life? So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. There you go. You didn't fuck up this time. Oh my god! Okay, Nico. Yeah. Do you really want to hear what's going on next door? <laughs> Do you want them to stir people? Oh, okay. <laughs> if they don't sell those, I swear to God, if they don't sell them my RL, I'm going to be suffering this because I kind of want one. <laughs> so you got Nico. And you got Special Week in an anime together, which it, it's still amazing that I found out that Adele is voiced by Special Week, dude. And now I want to cry because it's like, oh my god, it's been like forever since I've seen the Horse Girls anime. And I missed the damn show and I kind of wish that I got a second season. I still have not seen the OVA and I remember a lot of people were like, DJ, oh my god. Watch the OVA, and I had to wait until, like, December of, like, a couple of months after it came out. But, yeah. Things happened. <laughs> I'm literally debating on getting the book or making an eat a bag. Like, that I, like, I know who I want to make, but at the same time, I'm like, it's $8.00. The book is eight dollars. There's like I think six or seven books out officially as of right now. The next book comes out next month, and I really want to read this series. What are you barking for, weirdo? You just want attention. Goodness. <laughs> you know you can't stay here too long. Only for a little bit. And then you gotta lay in your bed. So, anything new? You want my water, but you got water out there. <laughs> Yeah. It's like that one lizard that like stands on his hind legs and just runs away. Imagine if that thing was like 
the size of Godzilla. Oh, hell no. Nah. Mm. <laughs> 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 You're slipping, puppy. Well, now we know. Mm -hmm. Supposed to be fog or... No, cold. You know, I honestly thought something was going to fall off, but no, since this is like the Kawaiianess of Isekai, you know, you can't have um, a head fall off in a cute anime. <laughs> no matter how bad you want it. They can't be like Magic Cooker or Magic Project. <laughs> oh, makes sense. Uh. Is that supposed to be Ultraman or some shit? Good job, guys. Yeah. But it is the perfect condition. Did you want it alive? Oh. So fresh. <sighs> Cheapskate. What are you gonna do? Basically, go sell it somewhere else. <clears throat> I mean, in a way, you're practically aware. Is her sadist gonna come out again today? Pauline is the type of person who you don't want to get on a bad side with. I mean, <laughs> I 
<laughs> Don't make me spit on my water. Oh, damn. <laughs> okay, how do I wait, 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 wait. wait. Mavis, why don't you guys just check your rank, your level? Let, let's just see how OP you guys are. Well, we don't really need to check Adele's, but here through yes! Yeah, you might as well listen to Nico. Nico be like that sometimes. She's just saying the truth. Would you rather have a big scary skeleton and a woman with like wings and a white dress? Would you rather have that instead? Or a vampire? Mm -mm. It just seems like you really want this. And that, I mean, it, it's kind of like she wants to prove something, not only to herself, but the others. That they can do and become an A-ranked team. I mean, the question is, how much are they going to level up, though? I mean, let's just think about that real quick. You know what's funny? And I was thinking about this last week. I always thought that any time that these... Oh, my God! Any time they would say the Crimson Valley, you know, the colors would just spark up. <laughs> Like, you look good. It's just like alternate outfits, like idol groups. Yeah. Well, maybe it's, it's just. It, it, maybe it's because, you know, you have really nice masculinity features, and that's good! It's good! Wait, wait. <laughs>
Raina. What's up, Pauline? <laughs> I don't think it's so wild. Hold on, hold on, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> 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 the antenna is dug in the finale. <laughs> See, now this just looks like. <laughs> A cosplay group, except one of them, Polly. <laughs> That's the wrong clothes. I can't take Polly seriously. <laughs> There's your secret weapon, Belkin. A bracelet. Uh, a rock golem? But okay, hold on, Mavis. You can't cut through that. That's frogs. Uh, see, exactly. Now, maybe if you had water, ice, something that just like. What? I mean, what the heck can you use to break a rock in half? It said it's been burned down really hard. And this one over here, fangirl. Fangirling the whole entire time until she died. She's okay. Well, of course I did. Yeah, because that was a like barely a scratch for her. I mean, do you not know how overpowered she is?
My freaking child is literally the Morgana of the group. You got a freaking slingshot and everything. Now you just need to tell your comrades to go to sleep later at night. And that you can't do anything else at night. Perfect. You know, right? Yeah. Wait, just mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. you would kill him. Well, I'm um, probably not. Probably just you, babe. They would end it right there. But it, it just seems like the reason why she killed those two guys is really just to get revenge for her father because her father died. And of course, she's going to blame them for whatever really happened. But because of the fact is this episode only really went a teeny tiny bit into detail on Reyna's class. I'm guessing we're not really going to know until episode five next week. And it makes me kind of wonder how like the book does it. In case, I mean, because, like, as some people who do comment on my videos for this series, and they say that certain things that happen in this show don't really happen in the, like, novel, but, you know, I still want to know because I am curious. And especially, like, I, I really want to know literally about everybody's past. But now, specifically with this episode, I really, really want to know about Raina and exactly what happened to, you know, have her father get killed. Why was she going to be sold out of everything for a little girl? I mean, where was her mom during this? Did her mom possibly die? And so, I mean, there's lots of unanswered questions with her specifically. But then you got to think about <clears throat> maybe it's Pauline and Adele. Adele, it, it, you know, with the first episodes, probably second as well, gave us a little bit. But I feel like still, I'm not going to say these girls as of episode five are like one dimensional because they're not. And they really have um, character development in each and every episode, but you still want to know what makes them them as a character. And this specifically with this episode as a whole was a Reina episode, really just proving herself and to others. And then now learning about her past, specifically seeing um, Maidu slash Adele on the ground like that, dead and then immediately getting a flashback to seeing her father dead like that so like i said i hope that episode five episode five um not four episode five episode five goes a little in detail but i mean if it doesn't i mean somebody's probably gonna tell me or um whenever i get the novels and i read them um that's how i know but uh, who knows i mean I don't know. I don't know. But I mean, it was good. It, it was nice to see these girls officially, like, out and about instead of, like, I mean, well, after graduating and then doing, like, one assignment for school. And then eventually it's like, yeah, we're in a guild. We're going to go on our, like, first two missions. This is our first, like, assignment as a guild together. So, you know, we should celebrate, like, mm -hmm, yes, partying-ish. And then doing a, um, what is the damn word? Um, not rescue, but just really, uh, protecting. There's another word that goes with the protecting, but I can't think of it right now. But, um, uh, I don't know. I mean, I, I just hope that with, like, five to wherever the show, I think the show's ending 12 episodes, 12 or 13, I'm not 100% sure, that... If any other girl has a backstory besides Maidu, Sushadel, um, 
I don't want it to be like two or three parters. Like not even two parters, maybe three parts. I don't want next week to be like, okay, let's go 15 minutes with Raina and then immediately go to someone else. They could do that. I think they may do that. If they do it, I'll be okay with it. That'll be a little nitpicky thing for me. But I don't, I don't know. It, it, they can literally do anything with these characters. And because of the fact is, it's not, from what everybody has told me from the last few weeks, it's not really following um, the book, per se. There's probably some things that they're following and then some things that they're not truly following. They could probably just be making it up as they go along, and who freaking knows. But I, I just still want to read the book, because I just want to know the differences of each thing, from the manga to the anime, and line up to the anime. Mm -hmm. That word. That word. But yeah, I really enjoyed it. I mean, heck, having <laughs> Adele, like, literally, dress as a maid, doing the freaking Moi Moi, moi Q, and everything, like, that kind of reminded me of fucking Happy Sugar Life. And when I reacted to that show last year, the so last year, yeah, it was last year. And how a lot of people was like, oh, like, you know everything about it. And I was like, eh, I can't talk about it. Then we'll get there. Because I read it like halfway. But yeah, it was a good episode. I enjoyed it a lot. And that's it. Other than that, guys, that is my reaction to towards episode four of Didn't I Say to Make My Abilities Average in the Next Life. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Magic Squad, and of course, I will see you guys special next Monday for episode 5. Bye, guys!